Gerard, five minutes left. Five minutes. You'll be taking over in five minutes. Well, he's got you got twenty minutes worth of stuff. Okay, Rick, you get out. He goes in five minutes well, it's only early. A Chinese jump rope now and then a human knot. That's yeah. right. Go. But there's there's three different Chinese jump rope yeah, things. So, the crew, the the crew, so there's 20 minutes. When I told you to teach the first part of the lesson, I meant for you to teach the first part of the lesson and him teach the roles. The what? The roles? The roles were first. Were they? Yeah. I mean, I got them in my lesson plan the huh? first, and it was all there. What's the name of our first? Uh, oh, we're just going on with okay. Basic Chinese jump rope. Okay, good. Basic. Yeah, they got, it starts out at your ankles, then you move it up. Oh, look at that skill level. You want to uh, become a student again? Yes, but in real life, would you ever have odd numbers to deal with as a teacher? Yes, so we need to throw that in there and see what he does. Okay, he's going to... I don't have a partner. stop and look Next like you are lost. And then you try to jump out and land on it. Remember that? 
<laughs> yes, that, yes, and you hope you have small tennis shoes. <laughs> yeah, not size 13. That makes it a little more difficult. You have to step over it twice. Spin out like a little kid, you know. They don't. Jimmy's going out of class. Let's see if he notices. <laughs> Remember, we do not send children to the principal's office unless we have no other choice. You gotta find them. I'm responsible. You are responsible for her. I guess you know. What do you want? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to My camera's coming around. We're going to watch you demonstrate. Ann's going to do a perfect job, land on it with no problem. <laughs> Stu got smarter. He took his shoes off. <laughs> That's <laughs> oh, the shoes. oh, no. It's harder than it looks. Yeah. You know, why don't y'all back up a little bit? We're not really little 10 year old kids. Watch the six foot four guy gets in there. And his arms go forever. Protect yourself. One, two. <laughs> not even close. Not even close. <laughs> So that's the king over there, huh? He's a, he, he got it first. Everybody's got to beat Stu. No. Joe's going to try. Oh, he didn't land on the... Oh, he did he get it, and my camera didn't see. So if there's no proof, did he really do it? <laughs> Uh, now you got to move it up to the knees and try it there. Yeah, first you got to get it at the ankles. It's at the knee level here. Oh, that, you, you worry me with those slick socks. I'm afraid your feet are going to fall out. His slide one is this issue. He landed in the middle and he still needed to fall. Stand nowhere to go. Yes. I'm so glad y'all wore matching socks today. Oh, she got out. She just didn't get on. Yeah, now Ann's going to try. <laughs> yeah, too slick. People might say. Yeah, you'll worry me without your socks on. Your feet could slide out from under you with no, if you don't. Speak. Yeah, people do do it without their shoes on. Uh, 
But they say it's a lot easier without the scars. Oh, it is. It's just I'm afraid they're grown ups and I'm afraid they'll fall. Right. Almost. Jordan. You know, if it was easy, it wouldn't be a competition. And how how expensive an activity would this be? I mean, you can if you are in a school and you can't afford equipment. You can go to Walmart and get these. Yeah, you could go get a whole roll and make you a bunch. Or you can uh, get your students to bring a pack of rubber bands and build them with one box. Yeah. So. yeah. That's where the milk jug game came up with. Oh, yeah. That's what you're going to do right now is the Korean Chinese jump rope. The first one is the basic one the in, out, in, out, in, out, on. Ready? Go ahead. Hold on, we're gonna, we're gonna have one group. We're gonna have one group demonstrate. Everybody circle up around here. Circle up. Yes. <laughs> Please don't fall. <laughs> you know, you uh, those socks, I hope they've got rubber on the bottom of it. Okay. We're gonna watch Joe do the first step. We're gonna put it all together once everybody's seen it. Alright? Let's go, Joe. In, out, in, out, on. Alright. The second one is oh, one foot in, one foot out. Still jumping out? Like this. Out, in, out, on. Third step. Third step is Third step is four count. I'm gonna stand on it. Rope, top four times, and then we're gonna. The next, this next step is one, two, three, four. See my foot, okay, so I'm gonna stand. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, you can jump as high as you want, as long as you stay on it. Last step, you did the ultimate? Yeah. Okay, last step is the seventh step, and then one, nine on the same thing. Seventh step. Yeah. So everybody's got to yell, right? Yeah. Everybody seen it? Yeah. We'll walk around and help you. Okay, let, let him demonstrate the whole thing together. Uh, we'll chant. Uh, you want to hold Yeah. In, out, in, out, in, out, on. In, out, in, out, in, out, on. On, 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 in, in, out, on. And then you move it up. And the one that misses up is out, and then you compete till there's up one of the three wins. Everybody see it? Yes, we're so. We're good. So, Jordy snuck out of class. He hasn't noticed yet. Elementary teachers have to have eyes in the back of their head. Keep going. I want to want to keep. Let's get this on video so the next student next students have an easier time teaching. Okay, let's chant. Come on.
Yes. What, what, what would you do if you lost a student? Sit down the rest of your kids. <laughs> he did? So he really went to the bathroom. He was holding the rope. He said, look, I need to go to the bathroom. Yes, and, and the t but the teacher didn't notice. <laughs> yeah, in real life, what would you make kids do if they needed to go to the bathroom? Take a money. Take yeah you, yeah, you do make them take a buddy, and then they have to have a hall pass, right? Uh -huh. yeah, uh, who is missing? Yeah, it's not a her, it's a him. He moves fast. I heard the door closed, but I ain't seen where he went. All right. Do you need me to go get him? You know what he is? Yeah. Somebody with shoes on needs to go get him. <laughs> Alonzo, you get Alonzo. Alonzo. Go go get Jordy. <laughs> okay, let's get back to our lesson before we Thank you. No, I, I, I thought you were doing it on purpose. Look, it does. It's a good lesson. It's a good lesson. He would. Yeah. Yes. You have to teach the kids if they want. They need to come to you. But you have to have eyes. You can't turn your back on your student. You get so involved in what you're teaching, you can't see the forest for the trees. Beginning teachers do this, I'm afraid. Come on, I want to see that at knee level. Yes, you are the man. You are the man. You can almost beat those 12 year old girls. I feel good about myself. Yeah, they're good. He did. He just wanted to look like the Grinch. So how could we make this competitive? If you miss, you're out. That, yes, yes. If you miss, you're out. It's the king of the mountain who lasts the longest. And we would do this with middle school, with, with lower level kids. We try not to make it competitive. We just success, you know, see how many times they can get it. Are you familiar with jump rope chants? Yes. You know? No? Yes. Teddy bear, teddy bear. Right? Well, uh, kids chant with this too. Yes, you can. <laughs> it's helpful to have those frog feet. <laughs> oh. Oh. She had to pause in there a little bit. <laughs> so is this um, something that increases fitness level? Yeah. yeah. Thank you. 
Immortalized onto YouTube. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's something I was just thinking about. Class. Class. <laughs> Good. Like that. Speaking thing. here. <laughs> okay. I was thinking about doing a little twist to the Korean jump rope now. A little twist. The Korean Chinese jump rope. <laughs> okay. Now. Remember the scissors, what we did earlier? You think you can do that with the Korean Chinese jump rope? Yeah, the whole step we did with the, the scissor motion. Hmm. I guess they're going to have to try to make up their own routine. So. Joe is definitely the student of the day, huh? Everybody come in to see Joe on the side. Never say that's Joe. Teacher, why don't I get a turn? You pick him every time. Can't you just see that? What do you, how are you going to answer that question? Yeah. Why do you have? Why do you got to pick Joe all the time? What else would they say, Geraldine? Teachers pick. But what else? What else would kids say? <laughs> did you have what? Yeah. What do you do if a kid curses you out? Everybody will get a turn with their group. This is Joe's group. That's why I picked him. Oh. Okay. <laughs> you ready? We're gonna see if Joe can do it, and if it's safe enough, we're gonna have to call. Oh no! It does look cool. <laughs> we didn't see that. Everybody come in. 